The only thing you can do as a Nigerian YouTuber is to fight for yourself. To be honest with you, fight for yourself. All right, good day, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, mommies and daddies, brothers and sisters. Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is the YouTube channel of Kayo De Father Share. So I am Kayo De Father Share. Please do well to like, share, and subscribe. In this video, we're going to talk about something very important. And I trust that because you are here, it caught your attention. So this is what you do for me. Relax and watch to the end. So for the topic of this vlog is how to survive as a Nigerian YouTuber. YouTube is a big thing. It's becoming a big thing in this, wo in this world. This is 2023. Yeah, I opened my YouTube channel sometimes around 20 2015 and I didn't know what I was going to do till now. So it has taken me a long walk, right, to be able to know what to do at this point in time. But So I have been able to grow my um, subscribers and, you know, watch out uh, from some 80,000, 80, 80, not 80,000, I beg, I'm still small in the game, but from 80 subscribers to over 200 subscribers. And the reason is because, number one, I became intentional about it. But there are some challenges I want to share with you. There are some um, things I went through and I'm still going through now that I think I can share with you. And I feel that when I share with you, you have a reason to start your YouTube channel in this year 2023. All right, so let's go. Let's let's just start. Let's just start. Let's just start. Let's just start. So, like I said, the only thing you can do as a YouTube, as a YouTuber in Nigeria, as a Nigerian YouTuber, whatever you call it, or whatever, well, the only thing you can do is fight for yourself. Fight for yourself, bro. Fight, fight, sister. Hold on. Fight for yourself. The reason why I think you should fight for yourself is because there's so much challenges in this country. Nigeria, my country. There's a song that says, I love my country, I don't go lie. Now inside that my go. Oh man, there is no time to live and die here. But the only thing we can do is define all odds. So as a Nigerian YouTuber, there's something I want to share with you now. Here's the thing. Um, in this video, I'm going to be discussing about challenges, right? Challenges as a Nigerian YouTuber, right? I'm going to be discussing about finding a niche. At the same time, I'm going to be discussing about how to overcome the challenges, right? I'm going to be, yeah, how to overcome challenges. So let's talk about challenges you face so as a youtuber in nigeria i'm specific about nigeria and i don't know where you're watching this video from but if you're watching from abroad if you're watching from america canada australia please you can also you know um chat with me like in the comment section below just do well to just say something about the challenges you face there but in this country that's what i want to focus on so one of the challenges we face in nigeria as a whole is lights so we are in, living in a country, see, I love my country, fine, but we're living in a country where we don't have a hundred percent power supply. So there are some times when you as a YouTuber, you feel that I need lights. In short, there are some YouTubers that already have lights fixed in their house because they want, they are intentional about it. But all they do is wait for Nepal to bring lights. We call it PHCN. Yes, Power you know, Corporation of Nigeria or NEPA. I don't know, but we still call it NEPA, yeah. So the, the thing is, now, having known this, some of us, like some YouTubers in, in quotes, wait for light. Bro, there is no light anywhere. Cosino, Cosino, I'm sorry, that means there is no light in Yoruba. There is no light. So that is one challenge that we face as a YouTuber. The next challenge we face is noise. If you can listen to my background, you can tell there's a baby crying somewhere. There is one Aboki man passing outside. There is a bike man here and there. And there's one thing about YouTubing. YouTube is you need serenity. You need this, you need this decorum so that you can, you know, you can give a good production, a good quality to the listeners and the viewers, right? That's one thing we face. We face another thing we face is data. Data, the rate at which data is being consumed in this country is crazy. I don't know about other countries. I've not been to any other country in this world. I've just been to Nigeria. I've not traveled out of this country before. But the truth is, I don't know how it works over there. You can also share the, in the comment section below how it works over there. But we pay a lot for data in this place. And trust me, there are times when, especially when you're using a, a laptop like me that does not have a battery. And you are about to upload a video on YouTube and you just have to pray for Nepal not to take light. And the moment the light goes, oh man, you will start again. And they tell you. So the thing is we face, one of the challenges we face is data. The next challenge we face again is getting gadgets. Getting a gadget, okay. So I have a lav mic, I have a phone, I have a camera right here. I didn't just get here all of a sudden. I didn't just get here all of a sudden. It took process, it took process. And the rate of Naira to dollar is increasingly crazy. And I haven't known that gadgets are on the high side. So if you want to get a camera, bro, you go cough them. If you want to get a microphone or more, you go cough the money. 
You understand what I'm saying? So these are the challenges I know you are facing. You are really facing these challenges. I know you're facing the challenge, but I'm going to be sharing with you how to overcome this challenge. How can you overcome this challenge? Because you have to start YouTube this year. I know that you have to be you have to be a partner in YouTube because YouTube YouTube is 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 helping content creators like me and you because you have to get on this platform and start doing something irrespective of the challenges. So let's talk about, let's just keep that aside. Okay, so let's talk about another one that is more like a challenge, but I feel that this one, I'll just give a piece of advice to you. Now, I'm sure you've gone on YouTube to check on, um, on how to find a niche. That is another challenge, how to find a niche. You are so, so talented that there's so much you can do, but you're still struggling with what to do. What can I do? What can I focus on? I want to build my community based on this. I want to build my community. Today you go on YouTube, you say tech is the main thing. You go in tech, you can't keep up. You say, okay, beauty is the main thing. You go in beauty, you can't keep up. You say food is the next thing. You go to food, you can't keep up. You say uh, um, um, content create, um, house, real estate, um, traveling vlog there's so much you can do here is the piece of advice I can give to you listen from me to you the best thing I could say is do what you can do till you know what works for you that's it do what you can do till you know what works for you like post as much as you can post if you're going to be posting I know they will say okay today you posted um, beauty tips today tomorrow you posted um, vlogging next tomorrow you post see my sister my brother I beg, do what you can do. Don't be static. Like, don't put yourself in the box. Did I say box? Box, B-O-X, yeah. Don't put yourself in the box, right? Don't put yourself in the box and think, okay, because I am a tech guy, I have to just make sure. If you are not a tech guy and you enter tech, oh man, <laughs> oh, <laughs> now listen, you have to just post it. Just post any video randomly. To be honest with you, you will have views. No matter what it is, you will have views. So I heard a story about a YouTuber that is one of those big YouTubers, not a Nigerian. She said that she started with uh, beauty. She she felt that she could always do beauty tips. And the first day she posted beauty tips, she, that was the day she realized, man, I, I this is not my thing. And she went for something else. So I would say that just keep posting, keep posting, keep posting videos, keep posting content till you find the one that you love the most. To be honest, I'm going through that challenge too. There's so much I can do, but the best I could do is post content, post videos, post whatever I can post till I get the niche I can get that would make me feel that this is what I'm looking for. And trust me, your subscribers will wait and your views will go up. Who will help you, no go stress you. Thank you. The next one is how to overcome this challenge. So I've spoken about um, the challenges, I've spoken about the gadgets, I've spoken about finding a niche, but the, the, the thing is, if I don't speak about how to overcome this challenge, then this video is not complete. And thank you for waiting till this time. If you love this video, please do well to like, share, and subscribe, and uh, I'm gonna love you till I die. So let's talk about how to overcome this challenge. So how to overcome this challenge is number one, ignore the challenges. Light, no day, we are back. If there is no light, my sister, my brother, my YouTubers, Nigerian YouTubers, if there is no light, video or do your content in the day. Right here, I'm seated here and I have the windows opened and I'm in an open space and I'm using the natural light. If never no bring light, nothing consign me. And they tell you, nothing consign me. That's vernacular in Nigerian English. All right, so. That's by the way, yeah. So ignore the challenges, ignore the challenges. Focus on what you have, number two. Focus on what you have. So I've met some YouTubers that will say, I don't have a camera, I don't have a black magic, I don't have a Zoom recorder, I don't have this, I don't have that. You will not have. I'm sorry to say, you cannot have. You will not have it. The reason is, look at what you have. Focus on what you have. Focus on what you have. Focus on it. If you have a small phone, right? Focus on the phone. If you can start with a selfie, if you can start with, you don't even need to have it all. A YouTuber said, get into YouTube unprepared. That is it. In short, I've given you my number four points. There's no point again. Get to YouTube unprepared. You don't have to be perfect. Like, you don't even have to be perfect. If there is no light, record during the day. If you don't have a tripod stand, put your phone on something to support yourself. To be honest with you, like I said from the beginning of this video, you have to fight. This is 2023. And if you're not fighting in this year, man, I'm wondering what you're fighting. To be honest with you, and Okay, so my memory card got exhausted. I could not record towards the end of the video. I have to look for another means to record this video. And um, I want to believe that this video made a whole lot of sense to you. If you didn't understand all I said, you can watch it from the beginning to this point again. 
and trust me man you guys are going to be doing very well so 2023 is a year where you step up and keep posting and be consistent on what you do if it's about the niche don't worry you'll find a niche as the time goes by but just make sure you're consistent there's so much noise in the environment already but i'm still going to post this video and you guys are still going to enjoy this video so please if this video made a whole lot of sense to you please do well to like share and subscribe and i'm going to see you on the next video god bless you man blessings blessings all the way blessings